This video covers the Skype for Business uh, and Avaya IP Office uh, plugin. Essentially, this plugin allows users to make and receive um, all the interactions using their Skype for Business client while using the IP Office to route calls in and out. So, looking at the Skype client here, hover over a user, then lists all the telephone numbers um, that are able to be uh, dialed. It allows a user to effectively change their call forwarding status on and off. So choose their mobile and any other numbers that are, uh, are listed in the settings. And the beautiful thing really is not just the fact that it, it allows organizations to use their Skype for Business client to make and receive calls, but it, 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 it means that they don't actually have to spend the money to deploy um, Skype for Business on-premises or pay additional fees to Microsoft for their Microsoft phone system SKU. Um, and each time they make or receive a call, it essentially updates the um, status field. So what I might do is uh, quickly generate uh, an incoming call into my extension. Quickly can ring. All right, so I've answered that call. I immediately get another screen pop uh, of Skype for Business. And this is where I can manipulate the call, um, place the call on hold, and the like. Um, easy enough to hang up on it. From an outbound perspective, if I just dial somebody manually, this is an example, come back, right click, uh, make a call out. It's obviously then just getting the dial tone back from my via, bringing the person behind me, uh, and life carries on. And we can see here, all importantly, is that the system has updated me to say that I'm in a call, in which case other users on the network know potentially not to send me an instant message because they're going to wreck my concentration. There you have it.